Hey there, it's Boots on here. I'm out in the shed and I've got a kitchen sink arrangement in the shed. And in the kitchen sink, I've got a glass bowl. This is what I use as a washing up bowl. This is the door glass out of a washing machine. I think it's a really easy way of recycling parts of a washing machine, so I'll show you how to do it. It's so outside over here, I've got a washing machine. This one's a Bosch. The door and fascia is missing. It's over here. I've taken it off because I was trying to get the element out, but it'll make it easier to show you how to do this. There's the door and fascia. And inside here, there's a hinge. It's just got two torque screws on it to get the hinge off, and then a number of torque screws all around, and I'll show you how to get that bowl out. So I'll begin just by taking out those two screws here. If the fascia was still on the washing machine and the door was still on the washing machine, it would be exactly the same process. Open the door, take out these two screws. That slides out. Then just work your way around, taking out all these screws. Some doors have a different type of glass in them with a kind of a bevel on the top and that means that it will still work as a bowl obviously but doesn't work as well because it doesn't sit as flat in the sink or whatever. The other thing you can use these for is as a mixing bowl for baking, fruit bowl for putting fruit in in the kitchen or wherever but I like them as a washing up bowl because they do the job really well. They must be some kind of a toughened glass or a heat treated glass because they will take a 100 degree or a 95 degree wash so there's no real fear of them there. This one's come out of a WFO 2865 model. Any of the WFO Bosches, any of the WFF Bosches and loads of other ones have these glass doors that don't have the bevel but you'll see it straight away when you, when you find one. Just lift it apart. Lift the glass out, whoop, and you lift the glass out, and there's a a glass bowl, just just like that. And I'll give that a wash because it's been sat outside for a bit and it has dust in it. It's got a few scrapes in it. This one, probably from belt buckles or jeans buckles or something like that. But they're quite a good bowl. This one doesn't have any little nicks in it. The last one did, and there's a model number. This one's a fifty-five. Four zeros, one two four. No, fifty five five zeros one two four, and that's what it is. Taking a look at some other washing machines here. This one's a hot point washer dryer. And you can see on the front it has this slope on it. So while it would work as a bowl, it'll probably not stand up too well. Now you might be able to lay it on this surface and use it as a fruit bowl that presents the fruit in a different way, maybe. Um, either way, it's just recycling, you know. And I reckon that kind of easy recycling where you don't have to put too much energy into it is the best kind. So there you go, a uh, washing up bowl from a washing machine. Thanks for watching, see you later.